This teacher video is relevant to theme handling data unit pictograms and in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to use the JIT software to create a pictogram to record the children's ages in your class. Okay so first of all I've located the JIT um, website by typing in this web address. You might be able to access this from the portal as well if you have access to the portal. Um, you can see that the orange button here says sign in so I'm obviously not signed in yet so I'm going to click on that. You'll then have to enter, uh, enter your credentials for your JIT account. So these are my credentials, my school name, my username and my password. Um, I can see that I'm now logged in because this has changed from sign in to save and then I can go across to the pictogram application and I'll need to create a blank pictogram like this. Now unfortunately there aren't any icons um, in the pictogram software to allow you to record a child's age so your alternative method is to use the brush tool here and a small brush and actually draw in the numbers into these boxes here so for example if you wanted to record um, the children that are four years old you could write a number four in here unfortunately the brush isn't fantastic and so it's quite difficult to draw uh, the numbers in here but something you could do to help that is rather than just use the the boxes with the uh, paintbrush tool you could actually write the numbers in the label here as well like that. now obviously the children in this for example year two class uh, will only be the ages of four five or six so I don't need these last two boxes so to get rid of those I can just use the minus symbol down here to subtract those last two boxes um, what I can then do is I can then ask the children to put up their hand if they are four years old and let's say for example in the class there are two people that are four years old you could get the children to come up and click on this or you can do it yourself and as you can see as I press the, uh, press the plus symbol uh, for the four year olds uh, it puts the four picture into my pictogram let's say for example there are ten five year olds you can see the effect that this has now this is one downside to the pictogram software because um, what it tries to do is it, it tries to maintain the size of the number five that I've drawn in this box and so to do that it cuts off the numbers themselves so unless you can draw the number extremely small inside this box uh, and still make it clear you're, you're going to have to put up with this solution uh, and let's say for example there are um, eight six-year-olds obviously um, it's not ideal that you can't see these numbers on here but you can clearly see from the labels uh, how many children are four we have one two how many are five we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and how many are six we have one two three four five six seven eight and you could get the children to count along with you or you could get the children to count how many people in the class are four how many are five how many are six and it's really good for the numeracy skills Obviously it's then very importantly expressed to the children that whenever we create a pictogram we put a title on it. So um, age of uh, class 2b um, and then we could obviously save this by pressing on the save button and now that's saved. And so that's just a nice easy way to create a pictogram to record the, uh, the age of the children in your class. Obviously you can use these tools as well, you could do for example um, the eye colour of, of people in your class uh, which would be a really nice uh, pictogram to make as well. 